don't stop. Alright, yesterday was day one of detox, um, day one of the steroid medication for my back. Um, I had fish and veggies, I had a salad for dinner, um, I had a major migraine all day, I was exhausted all day, I couldn't have any caffeine because of the detox. Um, I practically fell asleep by like noon, <laughs> um, but I didn't. I stayed up. I was one or two forty-one point six pounds yesterday as the start off of my detox weight. Today I am two forty point two, so I've dropped a full pound point two. Uh, Today I have taken my medication so far. I have to take the steroids throughout the day. Uh, we are still waiting on the washer dryer part so that we can do some laundry. I would have liked to done laundry today, but that's not gonna get done apparently unless we take the laundry somewhere. Other than that, I've got my my green tea, my detox tea non-caffeinated. I've got my water and I'll probably, it's 9 a.m. I'll do probably like <clears throat> tilapia and veggies for lunch and then maybe a salmon and veggies for dinner. Um, it's rough. The first day of detox was rough. So let's hope day two is a little bit easier. Day three of detox, day three of my steroid pack. Um, I have to take one tablet after each meal, but I haven't been doing three meals. My eyes look dark. I haven't been doing three meals. Um, so breakfast I've been doing with my tea and a snack because I'm just not hungry in the morning. I am down to 238.4. I have lost, let's see, hold on, let me do the math. I weighed in last time at 242 and I am down 241, 240, 239, 238. So four pounds in like three days. Um, again, that was not the purpose of this detox, it was to clean out my system and stuff like that. I'm only eating fish and veggies, I've got my nuts, which I need to go pick up from Walmart. I need to go to Walmart, because this was my last pack last night. Um, and I've got my, my detox tea, I've got my vitamins. You know, I ate so much yesterday, I was so full, and I still dropped a pound and a half. So, um, this detox is working really, really well, and hopefully it's cleaning out my system, flushing out my system. Um, no, my hair's not dirty, I don't know if you're looking at it, it's, I've got that spray stuff in it, the, the treatment or whatever, um, and you're supposed to leave it in. It just makes my hair look wet all day long so I'm gonna just brush it back and pull it back in a ponytail um, I have to babysit today uh, 11 30 a.m. to probably about three o'clock maybe a little bit later than that um, today's menu is probably I don't know tilapia for lunch and I haven't figured out dinner yet um, I have lots of leftover stuff from yesterday. Not like that's prepared because 
bought all got eight yesterday, but in the freezer. Um, I have a lot of leftover. I've got like half a bag of shrimp. I've got a ton of sea bay scallops, like a ton. <laughs> um, so I might do something. I don't know. I, I want a lot of it. I definitely want one of my Caesar salad bags that I have in there. I want a Caesar salad tonight for dinner. So we'll figure it out. So day three, down four pounds. <laughs> are crazy. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> um, so today is day six of the detox. Tomorrow is the last weigh in, and this road is busy as hell. Um, I'm going to my doctor's appointment today. I have my follow up for um, my back issues. My spine has been compressing onto nerves. You hear my engine? It's terrible. That's terrible. Um, so I've been having some pinched nerve issues. I had to go in for x-rays last week and all of that fun stuff. Uh, Thursday I still have to do a follow-up at the hospital with another doctor. So I'm going to my primary care today. I'm gonna get my way in for that because I have lost weight since last week and make sure that the doctor scale measures up with mine. I weighed myself this morning and it said 238.6 or something like that. No, point, I don't remember. Um, but then I like got on the scale an hour later and it said 238.0. So I have no idea what to mark my weight as today. Um, I'm going to just take it as 238.0 even though I didn't... Uh, I got a video of it, but I didn't get a picture, so I'm going to edit that and uh, make sure that's up to date. I know my Instagram is going to say something different because I took the initial weigh-in and it's not even around the time that I usually weigh myself because my appointment's at 10, it's an hour drive, and I usually weigh myself at 9, so I weighed myself at, what time is it now, 8.53, like 8.40. Oh, good golly. Lots of people out today. It's only Monday. Y'all need to be in work. So, I will keep you guys up to date on what's going on. Um, so far with my spine, um, the pain is still there. Uh, it's not as bad. The steroids have helped a little bit. The steroids did not affect my detox at all. As far as I can tell, I am not retaining water or anything. The unfortunate part is, is I do have bloating, so I didn't do any measuring or anything this weekend like I usually do every week. Um, I'm a girl. We get bloating once a month. So, I don't think it would be accurate measuring. So, I'm going to wait until next weekend to do any measuring. I can probably try to do a comparison photo of the beginning of the detox and now and see if there's any difference whatsoever. I highly doubt it. It's like four or five pounds difference so far that I can tell. Um, I don't feel any different, but I am closer to my next goal, which is to be at 222 pounds, which would equal a 50 pound loss. So I'm in the 230s. I'm in the upper 230s, but hopefully I will get to the 220s um, by the end of this month. That would be awesome. And then I can be closer to my goal. I don't know what to do when I hit 50 pounds yet as a reward. 
Um, my first two rewards, my first one was like 15 pounds and I rewarded myself with going out to paint some ceramics by myself and you know having a day to myself basically. And then my second goal was 30 pounds and I rewarded myself with new clothes as you saw in the last video. Um, I tried on new clothes that I hadn't been wearing for a month because I wanted to fit them. I wanted to reach my goal and fit them. Okay, that guy is ready. That guy's booty, so I'm not going to be up his booty. Alright, there we go. I'll get in my own lane. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to drive and go to my doctor's and I will update you guys uh, in a second. My doctor's visit went really well. My weigh-in last Tuesday was 248 pounds on his scale. Um, my blood pressure was 122 over 84. And today it has been one week. Today is a Monday, um, the second. And my blood pressure is 110 over 70. And my weight for him is 242.8, which means I lost five pounds. 5.2 pounds in one week uh, according to his scale so that's awesome So today was the final weigh-in and um, I'm at 236.6. I started this off at 242. Um, I need to double check my math, but I'm pretty sure that's six pounds lost in a week. And today is the last day of the detox. I am off all of the steroid medications. I still have my pain pills. Um, my back doesn't hurt as bad. It's now muscle pain more than anything. And the sciatica isn't like a sharp shooting pain anymore. So I guess I'm looking forward to Thursday to see if I can get x-rays and stuff done. Um, hopefully I can because uh, the doctor's office yesterday they didn't have a copy of any of the x-rays. They didn't have a copy of the spirograph that I did in December still. They didn't have a copy of anything. So these doctors aren't communicating between each other or something. I have no idea. But if I have to get the information myself, then I'm going to go get copies myself. Because I really want to see what's going on. Like, I'm a visual person. I have to see what's going on. Um, so, I'll figure it out. But this is my... Wednesday weigh-in and my one-week detox um, video so I hope you guys liked it I really appreciate you uh, supporting my channel and supporting me in my journey thank you so much please remember if you're not subscribed please consider subscribing hitting that red subscription button down below and clicking the thumbs up to be courteous on other people's videos uh, just to show that you've watched it and that you support their channel uh, and I would absolutely love it if you left a comment. Alright guys, I will catch you in another video.